How's it going guys? Right here I've got two 3D printed battery holders. Um, one of them is printed with a higher quality filament. These are both printed with PETG. One of them is printed with a bit of a higher quality filament and one is printed with a lower quality filament. And you can see the one on the right has just a crazy amount of bubbles in it. Now this happens, uh, yeah, it just makes the print really ugly, especially the bigger the nozzle you use, the uglier it is. Um, so why that happens is that in the filament, in the PETG, it absorbs moisture from the air. And so that's just something that PETG does more, like way, way more than PLA and ABS. So the way that I solve that is I got this food uh, dehydrator. It's just the commercial chef brand. This is like, I don't know, 40 bucks or something on Amazon. It's got a little knob with degrees in Celsius. It's kind of dirty right now because it usually sits outside. And these racks are designed for uh, dehydrating food, like for creating, you know, jerky or uh, dehydrated fruit or whatever. Um, so I just have two racks on here. And then I 3D printed this. It's a little bit ugly. I did it a while ago when I first got my giant um, AnyCubic printer, AnyCubic Chiron. And so this is 3D printed. And that allows me to <clears throat> create a filament dryer. And so I can put my uh, PETG filament in there, just like that. <clears throat> and then it, it fits nicely, like that. And you just plug it in outside usually, uh, unless it's the winter time, because it literally just blows hot air at the filament. And it's good to do it for, I mean, I usually let it sit overnight and then it prints beautifully. It looks a lot more like the one on the left versus the one on the right. So um, yeah, that's just kind of one of the funny, annoying things about PETG. And it took me a little bit to figure out why the heck it was looking so disgusting like that. Um, that's just a lot better print. So hopefully that helps some of you guys. If it did, make sure you leave a thumbs up. It really helps out with the videos. And uh, make sure you subscribe. I do videos all the time about 3D printing and about building drones and um, talking about investments and Bitcoin and all kinds of stuff. So thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. And we'll see you in the next video.